Hey everybody, I know it's been a hot minute since the last video. Been a little busy, especially since the, the new DLC for Elden Ring just came out. I might stream some of it off my, my PlayStation. Rude. I haven't decided quite yet though. So we are picking up where we left off last time. I think this is like the, you pick a knife from the sink and give it a wash. So I gotta catch a knife. It's been a, a, a few minutes since I last well, it's been more than a few minutes since I last played. It's been a long while since I last played. But, um, we're just gonna pick up. We're gonna see how it goes. Finish the game. Well, not finish the game. Finish this episode of the game that's out. Your success story is such an inspiration to us all. Before starting on your soda company, you used to be a surgeon, isn't that right? That's right, Mark. I am actually a doctor, so trust me. One kind of toxic soda a day keeps me far, far away. <laughs> when even a doctor tells me to indulge, how can I not? Surely it's only up from here. What plans do you have for the future? Well, first of all, with such a great demand comes a great need for water. Which is why I've partnered up with several water distribution companies. I hope this is the start of a long-lasting friendship where... People on the TV ramble on and on. You're relieved there's absolutely nothing about any dead girls being found but yeah it's been, a, it's been a while since we last played i figured i might as well you know pick up where i left off continue on hello son hi dad um pick up where i left off at just honestly try to finish up this episode bye dad oh no 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 i'm not jumping Huh, huh? Right, it's just a job. I can always find another. Your mother said I was too good for that one anyway. Alright, wait, you got fired? Well, life goes on, I guess. Precious, precious life. We're all important, Anders. It's Andrew. I'll go see what they've got for me at the unemployment office. Great talk, son. But yeah, I'm gonna, um, see, see how much... Well, not how much, but we're gonna finish up this episode and go from there, honestly. Just, um, I haven't decided what game I'm gonna move on to after this one. It's just something I probably should, uh, figure out. I'll probably do a Slay the Princess, because I bought that a little while ago. Well, I bought it all as but still, I bought that a little while ago. Maybe it'll be good to play. What are you doing with that knife? Briefly, you wonder if killing her would be worth it. I'm going to make a blood oath with you. But in return, you'll have to promise me something, too. Okay? Keep my secret and I'll keep you company. And what if I don't? Guess. <laughs> You're all bark. You wouldn't do anything. If you'll ruin my life anyway, what reason is there for me to keep up appearances? Moreover, I'm doing this for you. Then what happens if you break the promise? I won't if you won't. I'm not buying that. Layla, you are, the, you are a miserable, loathsome being that has wormed its way into every aspect of my life. And for that, my heart will always have a rotten, moldy sore spot just for you. Make of that what you will. I mean, I'll take it, but she's... <laughs> gently, you asshole. How does one cut someone gently? A better man would know. Whatever. And thus, she forever keeps her mouth shut. Only as long as you keep your eyes closed. Hmm? Let no hussy steal your gaze. It's just us now. I said I'd be around. I never said there wouldn't be others. Wait, no, I want to do over. Too late. A promise is a problem. Promise. Andy, that's not fair. Oh, don't be like that. I make you a priority. It's not the only. It's not enough. Why can't you just kill our parents? Hold on, that's not what she said back then. Do it for your cute little sister. I know you want to. Kill them to solve all your problems. Kill them to feel something. Kill them for food. Kill them to avoid the things I'll do to you if you don't. What is that supposed to mean? Look who's awake. Good morning. Or night. It's still night time. What do you want, you little creep? To offer mom and dad to the demon. Right now? Right now, while they're asleep, we'll set the ritual thing up and do it. I'll give you plenty- I've given you plenty enough time to figure this out. Yeah, you haven't. 
So now we're doing it my way. Okay. Oh my, my efforts were far more effective than I thought. Welcome back, Andy. That's not it. But you do have a, you have a point mom might snitch on us. I knew that even before we got out of our apartment. I don't know why I let myself think anything else after talking to her. It's because at your core you're just a soft gooey marshmallow. If it weren't for me, all kinds of vile women would have gobbled you up already. Chomp. <laughs> what are you doing? A demonstration. God, you're so fucking dumb, I should. Andrew, are you still awake? Yeah, yeah, why are you still up? I thought you had work tomorrow. I want to talk to you without Ashley. It's not really a good time right now. Look, I know it's late, but this is important. I've been thinking things over and I believe I owe you an explanation. That's alright. I don't really need to know. I'm really tired. Andrew, I understand if you're angry, but at least listen. The whole situation with Ashley was... Oh. Oh, go on, Mom. Don't mind a little old me. For the love of God, this had better not be what it looks like. Haha, <laughs> whatever. How does this look to you? But where do you get... What's it looking like now, Mom? Uh, Ashley, come on. Ashley, put that away. There's no need for this. Be quiet and start walking. We're going to the basement. And don't get any funny ideas, because I will shoot. Andrew, go get some rope. Go get a rope or something. I'm tying this bitch up. Don't kill Dad. You did not need to be told that. Well, time to um get rid of our parents then. In that uh in that case, honestly, well, I mean, it's not like they weren't gonna do it. Anymore. Let me turn the game audio a little bit in my thing. There we go. It's not like they weren't gonna do that anyway, though. Like, let's let's all be real here. The parents, the parents are getting gone either way, man. I wonder if this is fine. Should we untangle the rope from everything else? Ah, oh, shit. Nice one, motherfingers. Son, what on earth are you doing? I'm right, sorry. I need to uh sell a little. And the truth is, I want to tie mom up. Doesn't sound any better. I'm gonna fuck myself? Oh, yeah, that'll do. Where's your mother? Do you want to get something from the basement? Actually, I think she should, she could use help. Here's your father. Just check up on your mother. Got rope. Maybe you should hang yourself with it. <laughs> it's alright. Honey, is everything alright? Take out your cleaver. What, what's going on? A Andrew, weren't you supposed to be masturbating? Just walk down, slow and steady. Tie your father up with the rope. Can't help but notice some old rope burns on his wrist. Better not dwell on it, as you'd rather not visualize how they came to be. Andrew, check when she has something on her. Well, does she? No. Tie your mom will use her Christmas lights. So this is what your life has come to. Alright, good. Now do you remember how to perform the rip? Hold up. Mom, what's the pin for your credit card? Is that what this is about, money? You go this far just for a quick buck? What's the pin and where's the card itself? It's in my purse. She tells you the pin. And you scribble it down on the note. Okay, then I'm gonna go and try this now. Ashley, stay here and don't do anything. That depends on them. She gave me the wrong pen and you end them doing what? Again, it depends on if they behave or not. Alright. I'll be quick. I got the purse. I got the card. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing here? Get back downstairs. They're not going to try anything. It only takes one of them to start screaming for this whole thing to blow up in our face. It is amazing how cooperative a person is with a gun pointed at them. Yeah, so go point it. I'll be right back. It's just... <sighs> Come on out with it. I need to get going. You're with me on this, right? Sacrificing him? Didn't I already say so? Well, you have this habit of flip-flopping. Let... Fuck. <sighs> Look, just trust me, Ashley. We're doing this. You're the best. Come back soon. Yeah, yeah. I'll see you in a bit. 
and now we get to play as Ashley. Well, Andrew is busy picking up the money you decide to sell for ritual. Or at least what you remember of it. Let's think. I think it evolved. This one's kind of we might have already draw. I think that was drawing blood too. Some blood. Got a knife. Let me go cut one of my wonderful parents that's down here. Alright, so here's what's going to happen. I'm going to cut one of you draw some blood. And if you scream, I'll blow both of your brains out. How about that? Take the money and go. What do you need our blood for? Oh, so now you care what I'm about. Don't, don't you fucking act like I haven't tried with you, Ashley. You're the one who shut me out. But even then, I've stuck my neck out for you all this time. Oh, like the time you left me in a star for three months? Was that you looking out for me? Oh, gee, thanks. You know goddamn well what I'm talking about. I never told anyone what you two little psychos did to that girl. What are you talking about? Take your meds. I know you and Andrew did something to that classmate of yours who went missing. I knew it the second she was found dead near that warehouse you used to play at. <sighs> Whatever. If I didn't love you, I could have rid myself of you right then and there. When it comes to being a mother, I am a fucking saint, Ashley. A saint. Ah, yes, the patron saint of covering one's own ass. Do you have any idea what they would have done to you if they found out? Now then, you pay God the virtue. Let's see whose blood I should use. The mother. Huh, honey. It's fine, don't worry about me. Yeah, she wouldn't worry about you in return. Alright, let's see here. Something like this. Let's finish drawing this masterpiece. Audra, a circle. Do you even know what a circle is? Because it's not that. Never, you never. No, no, don't let her get a rise out of you now. Candles, candles, candles. Some in this box? No. Candles. One on each corner. Alright, that's all the candles I had. We'll come back. Now we can talk to you. Andrew, give me a hug. You have a draw limit on your card? I do. You do? I can only get a couple hundred before it locked me out. How oh, I suck it, bitch. Being insufferable runs in the family. Yeah, well, guess what? Now all, now we all get to witness the wonders of customer service. Get up. You have a call to make. Ashley, take her to the phone. You draw your gun. Off we go. Aaron, look, as the customer service line has just opened for the day. Yet somehow there's already a million hour wait. So guess what? You wait. Please hold a representative will be with you as soon as possible. Please hold a representative. <laughs> I'm not going to read that again. Dang, they're holding for a, forever. Roughly a quarter millennia later, when it gets a hold of someone. Sorry, let me just confirm. Say you want me to remove the draw limit altogether? That is what I said, yes. Wow, that's crazy. What if your card gets stolen? Indeed, I'm not at all being held up. There you go. You go. Is there anything else I can help you with? Apparently not. All right, then have a nice day, Mr. Graves. Now, back into the basement with you. And don't think for a second I didn't see the stunt you were trying to pull there. It's just small talk. All right, now we gotta take our back into the basement. Into my circle. The car should be freed now. Like your mother, whom Andrew ties quickly back up. I was looking at what you said up here, and let's just say it's not quite there, is it? Yeah, I don't remember what the little runes look like anymore. God, your memory is such shit. They already figured as much, so I sketched them out for you. Why don't you just draw the runes itself? The blood's right there. Because you might have a good reason for not drawing them yet. Alright, fair, whatever. Give me the car, I'll go pick up the rest of the money. I really don't like the idea of you wandering all around all by yourself this hour. It's already morning though. Well, yeah, but I mean still. Just hand me the card. I actually, can I really leave Andrew alone with mom and dad? 
who knows what they'll say to him. And he's wishy-washy enough as it is. Ashley, you wonder if you can trust Andrew enough to leave him alone with your parents. So, I'm going to save the game. I'm going to trust him. Give me the card. Go get the money. Please be careful. Aren't I always? When are you ever? See you later. I'll, it'll be fine. He won't turn me as long as I have the trinket. Okay. So I am going to go back and like whatever options I didn't do. Um, I'm going to go back and do them, of course. You know, so we're going to do all the routes that are in the game, of course. There's nothing you can do about the missing audio, but at least you can draw the missing runes. Now where to actually get all this blood? Blood. she making you do this? No. Are you really going to kill us? Come on, of course not. Technically, anyway. Then what is all this witchcraft looking nonsense? Just let her scare you a little. We'll leave you alone after that. How about that? It's hard to say whether she believes you or not. There was something I tried to talk to you about earlier. I don't really care, honestly. About Ashley. What is it? I want to apologize to you for always making you look after her. That was wrong of me. It's fine. Can you imagine what it was like for me back then? When I was your age, I was already stuck with a seven and a five year old to care for. Think you'd have fared better than me? I wouldn't know. This is an excuse. Mind you, it's an explanation. I never hated you. I was just a fuck up. D don't say that, honey. We did fine. Ha, so fine. Look where we are right now. Anyway, you're such an easy child. I thought we'd, just be, we'd be just fine having another. But the count on Ashley to be so. Sorry I made you raise her. I thought you were getting along, so I didn't want to see what was happening. And for that, I apologize. It's all my fault. I apologize. Well, it is what it is. It doesn't have to be. I think we can still sort this out. Is that right? If it's money you need, I can help you get a job. They're hiring at your company, aren't they, love? That's right. If I put in a good word for you, you're as good as hired. Before one, though, they get a lot of difficult customers there. But I know you can handle it. Should be easier after easy after handling Ashley all this time. What do you say? Parents are offering you an olive branch. So I'm going to save again on five, on six. I'm going to accept the olive branch. <sighs> I want to say yes. Wish I could say yes to that, honestly. But I can't. I'm stuck. So fucking stuck you don't even know. Is it the death certificates? I know she had moved them. There must, there must have been some ugly mix-up. We can clear that up. It's a lot more to it than that. Nothing's happened that can't be fixed, Andrew. And I'm not angry. I know you didn't want to do this. All you have to do is convince Ashley to give you the gun and we can put this behind us. Fuck this. I need to light the candles. I can make this work. We're going to be just fine. All Ashley needs to do is stop being such an unrelenting cunt. We'll be fine. We're going to be fine. Andrew? You get the gun from her, right? I'm back. Great, the ritual's ready. I can't even get a proper hello. Can you just summon the damn thing? What's wrong? Everything will be... Everything. Will you just get to it, goddammit? Sheesh. You are Ashley. Ahem. <clears throat> hello, hello, Mr. and Miss Demon. I'm sorry I don't have the mood music, but I have some other... I have the other stuff you asked for. No answer. Maybe if I sing something. Please don't. Mercifully, the demon shows up to spare everyone from the second-hand embarrassment. Ah. Tarsal. What the fuck is that? Offer of those two. Showing a short-lived as the demon steals their souls. I wonder if I should feel something. Well, anyway, so the music wasn't needed to summon you after all? I have to play it last time, then. The circle is hard to find. Sound is easy to follow. However, you have my talisman now. It makes you easy to find. Speaking of which... A deal's a deal. Charge it up, please. My trinket works again. Thank you. What? What? Hello? This is the brother. Yep, the one and only. He may not be very useful, nor is he particularly loyal, but... But nothing, actually. Honestly, I don't even know why I keep him around. I see. Farewell, tar soul. Until you have another soul to offer. Right, thank you, and bye-bye. The entity leaves. I don't know why you keep why I keep you around either. I guess you're just stuck with me, aren't you? So stuck you don't even fucking know. Ah, uh, knees dropper. And you've misunderstood I'm in our situation. 
Sure you did, for sure, Ashley. It doesn't matter now. Ashley, I picked you. I don't want to talk. Come on. I don't care. What are we going to do about the bodies? Ashley, uh, the bodies, Andy, focus. Right, the uh, body, bodies, uh, well, on one hand, we didn't kill them, but on the other hand, maybe that they just fucked off somewhere. Who knows? Meanwhile, there's a murder investigation. Right, so let's make them disappear. All right, we can start by chopping them up. Can we just dump them in the ocean or something? No, actually, we're going to make them vanish. No, no wash up ashore somewhere. Uh, how to go about this? We can't leave a mess behind. There's a drain right there. Uh, right, you are. I'm tired of the parents but stops. Wait, what? What is it? Is Dad breathing? Take a look, and sure enough, his chest is moving ever so slightly. Aha! Ah, he is mom too. Try various things, but nothing gets a response from your parents. Yet their heart still beats, their lungs draw in air. Oh God, what is this? Maybe losing your soul just turns you into a vegetable. That can't be. The cultists died in the warden too. Well, I mean, did you actually check? I sure didn't. I just went to town and started chopping. No, no, no. Please tell me he wasn't alive when we ate him. What the fuck is so funny about this? Come on now. I'm sure he died pretty quickly from blood loss. If not, you ripping his head off must have done the trick. It'll be the same with these two. Get, get it cutting. Not that. This changes everything, doesn't it? You want to leave them like this? They're not getting their souls back. Though, if you want to leave them to starve, I'm all for it. Wouldn't it be a little poetic? I'm sure you'd like that. Uh, I don't know. I need to think. Oh, come on. Where are you going? No, Andrew. Look. Look here for a sec. What? Get your father, too. What are you doing? There. All dead. Now, tell me again. How I always make you do all the dirty work. He'll bitch and moan. Surely he'll bitch and moan as per usual. But you did not miss that sigh of relief. Anyway, we drag our parents' soulless and lifeless bodies over to the shower. Alright, I'll start cutting. You got the blood into the drain with the shower head. Gotcha. Whoa. Whoa, what? Stop, stop, stop. It's flooding. Huh? Oh, what the hell, gross. Great, the drain is clogged up. And lit a screw on shot. I need a screwdriver. You just keep chopping the bodies like you some unclogged drain with. Um screwdriver. Oh, this vinegar. No, no vinegar is gonna help me very much. Okay. Screwdriver. Clog the thing. Screw the lid and pour it some. Okay. I need bacon soda too. This is the kitchen, okay. All right, we got bacon soda and vinegar. And just gonna slip, pour some, pour in some vinegar. Wow, oh, okay, who gives a shit? So this starts bubbling up, but the cause it's a bit. What we try? Use some rubber gloves. I'm the one who's gonna have to get in there. But of course, I am but a dainty little lady. Can't expect me to do a man's job. Fine, just give me the gloves. Okay, luckily there's some gloves right here. Very luckily. Here you go, have fun. Hand to Andrew the rubber gloves. He digs out God knows, he digs God knows what out of the drain. Seemingly never ending, ending amount of God knows what. Oh God, that is disgusting. Oh, I'm gonna gag. You're not helping. Fuck that's gross, Andy. Andy doesn't respond to anything to that. Good, good. Looks like he's finally coming around. Though there's no being, though there being no reaction at all is a little worrisome. The drain works. Let's get this over with. Your brother dismember your parents and disembowel them and decapitate them. What fun. Would I be allowed to say so if I did? Of course, you can tell me anything. Anything I want used against me anyway. <laughs> I love you, Andy. I love you, I love you, I love you. Sorry for lashing out earlier. I forgot how hard this is for you. I'm fine. No, you're not. Talk to me. Oh. I got nothing to say to you. Andrew continues butchering your parents. 
And for the first time in forever, you have no idea what he's thinking. So what's the plan for all this? We're to dispose of it all. Yeah, yeah, but how? We'll use whatever means available in the house. Let's look around and see what we can do. A lot of limbs. Two torsos. Got the other head. Oh, can we burn the bodies here? It would be like cremation. There's no way the temperature of this thing gets high enough. Boo hoo, watch. Plus, torso above the fireplace. And the rose's eyes will light the fire free. What do you look at that? Nothing I don't have. Get him in the goddamn it. This isn't working. You seem kind of hungry, though. Let's leave this be for now. Well, I'm not gonna find nothing in there. Pretty sure. We got to turn some of the meat into a soup. Throw some vegetables, maybe spices, and then throw the rest away as scraps. What do you mean the rest? What do you think I'm eating some? What do you do what you want? Let's see if you made early word ingredients again. The recipe is right there, read it. Shame on me for thinking you'd be helpful. It was meat, onions, potatoes, and carrots. Chop everything up and throw them into the pot. Ah, there we go, thank you. I knew you memorized it, you fucking nerd. You're welcome. Mm, go grab some stuff from the garage. Potatoes, carrots, get them onions. We're going to chop them up and take a little nibble. Cut the limbs and chop meat. What do I do with the face and make a mask out of them? I don't know. Throw them in the fireplace. But the skulls. What well, skulls we can deal with later? Along with the other, with all the other bones. That much better than your suit. Is there anything else we need to deal with? Um, we just got the rest of the stuff in the fire. Oh, we gotta uh, get the blood off the floor, too. Or something else I'll do to do. Let me look in here, I guess. I don't think there's anything else that needs to be done. I guess I'll just wait in here. Super. Uh. Can I look in the purse again? No. What am I missing? be missing something that I cannot find. Oh, I guess I should probably put this board down. I can't take it down. Missing. 
Hmm. There we go. How's that good? It's gone. Great. Now deal with the rest of the body parts. Apart from you, this is overwhelming, huh? Um, what other body parts? Think soup's ready yet? Uh, okay, I can check on soup now. Dinner is ready. I'm eating too. Of course, this is the last hearty home cooked meal for a while. That's for a while. You're not. Re you're really not gonna have any. I honestly don't see the point. If you're hungry, there's other food available. Hmm. Don't you want to feel powerful? Explain. Well, uh, hmm. let me think. Okay, so humans are at the top of the food chain, right? And then when I come and eat the humans, I'm on top of that. It's not really how it works, but whatever. Then is this your diet? Now you sacrifice people and eat them for kicks? Oh, you're not getting it. Let me explain it again. I don't need to get it. I just need to know if this is going to be a thing. I don't know who's going to have to sort it out. It's like if I eat someone I'm eating their entire life so far. Like everything they've known and felt, I'm consuming all of that. If I could turn that into some sort of energy, I'd be all powerful. Does this power leave you? Leave a shit? <laughs> you set the corpses up? No, no, it's just like absorbing nutrients. I get to keep the energy. You say so. You're not good at good at all. If I could actually absorb someone else's life, what would I do with that? I have no desire at all to be our mother or father in any capacity. Well, those so I'm gonna shit out and flush down the toilet. <laughs> Oh, there finally. Nothing. Well, anyway, I think we've dealt with the flesh the best of our abilities. But we still need to do something about the bones. Well, first of all, I need to ditch the leftover suit. While you do that, I'll clean the kitchen. What am I going to do with this suit? So we're just going to pour the soup in the trash can. Okay, cool, I guess. I need to figure out what to do with all the bones. For now, I'll collect them all before I actually lose track of them. So I just gotta grab all the bones. So I just burned charcoal, but the bones remain. Alright. So I got all the bones. Now we're gonna. Ooh. So, what do you do about these skulls? They could have thrown those into the ocean along with the rest of the bones. So much making them disappear, huh? What did we do all this other crap for? Quiet now. As long as the teeth are removed, they should be fine. Based on what logic? The uh, dental workers, I guess? You guess how nice. Forgive me, oh beloved, for I have never gotten rid of a body before. Hoping one can't identify someone based on their bones alone. The bones slip, though. Aren't they kind of like sticks? I'll find something to weigh them down just in case. Teeth, some more teeth. I'm about to flush the teeth down this toilet if I can. Oh, all gone. So, we, so we lose the teeth, bag the bones with some rocks. Call it a day. Got it. Uh, I'm gonna go grab some 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 of the rocks out the yard. Imagine your kids come to visit only to murder your ass and turn you into soup and then put your ass in a bag and throw you in the ocean. That's crazy. Finally, all that remains now is cleaning up the basement. Uh, do we have to? Yes, obviously. Why? We'll have to sacrifice someone again later anyway. Why would it have to be here? We're going to live here, right? We just have to keep paying our parents rent or whatever. Wish we could, but eventually someone's going to pay gonna go hey my grace hasn't shown up to work in a while so they get fired so what I doubt either of their bosses will care enough to follow a missing persons report there's also the fact that they apparently mingled with the people here the neighbors will notice them gone despite their names still being on the door we can tell some lies say we're house watching for our parents and so on Listen, not everyone gives zero shits like you. They have co-workers, friends, other family beside us. What a bunch of whores. Why weren't they happy with just each other? I didn't apply to fuck any of them. Irrelevant. It's all the same. Anyway, they can't all they can't all go. Haven't heard from those two in a while. Oh well. Someone's gonna come looking with the authorities. 
And who will they find? The children who didn't follow their who didn't report their parents missing. Officer asks, "How the fuck are you dead anyways? If you don't want to stay here, just say so. It's not that I don't want to. I just don't think we can. Well, can we at least use their IDs? We can be the new and improved Mr. and Mrs. Graves. We run into the same problems as with our own IDs. Once the authorities start looking for them, they'll see what we've been up to with two with theirs." Sorry, Ashley. I wish it was that easy. Whatever. I'll clean the basement then. Time to clean up all this blood. God damn it. I thought... We were in a clear after all this. Oh, whatever, we need the mop. Well, there are many mops down here. Excellent mop. Oh, this is, I guess, is super easy to clean up. So this is, they have like six mops in their basement. Which, I mean, who keeps all, who keeps so many mops? Should I put the candles back in the box? One of these days, I'm going to have to do like a, I don't know, play through of a game I'll play more often than some of this other stuff. I don't know. All done. Are we ready to go? I think so. There's no way to, there's no way to tell if we miss something still. Other than maybe see if you have a dream when we're, we're called, I guess. Offer two souls so it stands to reason I have at least two visions to come. How about I take a nap and see if a disaster awaits us? Please do. Where are we going? Take this nap. Into our parents' room. So we're the conditions to get a vision. As in what did the demon say about it exactly? Hell if I remember. You don't? Ugh. Could you possibly give it any less of a fuck? That'd be great. Oh do you forgive me, your highness. It's been a week or two. And up yours, you didn't even remember our parents' address. Which is, of course, just as important as this. Look, it just said I have to hold on to it to have clairvoyant dreams. That's it. It was in my pocket last time when it happened. Then could I hold it this time? Nope. Oh, come on. Even if you have a vision, you just freak out and everything. Your dumbass can barely understand what's happening in the present, much less in the future. If anyone should be deciphering what these dreams are about, it should be me. Screw you. Now I'm definitely not letting you have it. Oh, fine. Just fine. Whatever. That was uncalled for. You're not getting my trinket. Fine. Whatever. Have an awful night and terrible dreams. Drew fucks off somewhere and you go to sleep. Ooh, well, this looks familiar-ish. Is, is the demon summoning me again? I said it would. Something's about to go. Maybe I shouldn't stay here? Cut these trees down. Um, um, do I cut the side down? Alright, go, 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 go. Probably shouldn't leave the path of the purpose. I 
I guess this is cool. Mm. I like the mechanic with the the, the demons. I probably shouldn't have put that pedal there, but uh, oh well. Okay, yeah, so don't put that pedal there. I didn't mean to do it anyway. It was a, an accident. That plank. So I put that pedal there, then I can't get up there to get those three pedals. I need those three pedals so I can uh, continue moving. So it cost me four pedals to get over there. I gotta make sure I don't accidentally use them there. Okay. I missed the key. I didn't take the key. Uh, probably gonna send me back. Well, cause I doubt I can do much without that key. So what's through this door, I guess? Off. Oh. So both these doors are locked. What's down here? Will it let me go back? So, I'm just gonna make a, a different choice this time. And I'm just gonna play through it again. Okay. It's ridiculous. Can't believe you brainwashed Andrew play along with this. Brainwashed in my ass. You see, you're allowed to talk anyway. No one cares about what you think. Don't talk to your mother like that, young lady. Please. Since I, uh,. I uh, miraculously mess up the, the scene. I'm just gonna uh, do this again. Okay, he's back. I'm about to summon. Do this. Okay, we're just gonna skip through all this dialogue. Realistically, I probably should make the save. That's fine. Mm. I'm not gonna read this because we've already read it.
But um, yeah, I'm gonna try to play some some different games on the channel after this. Probably, I don't know, I might play episode 3 of this if, if, whenever it comes out. If it does, if it doesn't, it'll be fine. I mean, I don't know. Either way, I think I'll probably make this maybe the last episode of Andy and Lele. We'll just have to see. skip through this dialogue because you know I actually love uh, the actually uh, uh fucked up the rest of the shit in the um, the little chase scene or whatever. So I'm just gonna speed through this real fast. As fast as I can anyway. So that we can get back to that. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna read any of this dialogue because it's, it's just the same. But, um, I am thinking of maybe like I don't know I don't know what game. I don't like some RimWorld. I I like RimWorld. That's it's something like it's a game I've took a lot of hours into, and it's just like honestly like I could I could play it for such a long time. Oh, it's such an enjoyable game. Well, I think it's enjoyable anyway. I, I don't really be playing it that often, to be honest. Uh, I do play it often, but be playing. Got got a lot of mods on it. Um, no, I was supposed to be doing. What am I supposed to be doing? This is my trash can. Super goes in the trash can. But yeah, I'll probably probably play these from Rim World. Let's find some satisfactory recently, so I'll, I might play some of that. I don't know. I haven't really thought about it yet. Um. Just like all, all, all that. Look at the rock in his back. 
Oh no, this game, this game right here is pretty, pretty decent. I've seen some other small games I think about playing on the channel. I don't, I haven't really decided yet. Thinking about, I don't know. Maybe, maybe buying one of the background games, playing some of that on the channel. We're doing some more streams. Do some more streams with friends. See how it goes. I'm gonna try to figure out restream. Um, and maybe, maybe stream the Elder Ring DLC. I, have, I, I mean, I've already started the Elder Ring DLC. It's, it's, it's very hard. So far, very very difficult, very difficult DLC in my in my humble opinion. Oh well, look, we're already back at uh, where we need to be at, which is good, honestly. So I'm just gonna skip through this dialogue. Look at these flowers. I gotta remember to pick up the key. I'm gonna save. Save this time. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to be more consistent on the show. Um, Cause I feel like once, once I get my consistency down, I'll probably, probably be a lot better. Especially like when I'm just like posting. So I try to I try to post my lockdown. I feel like I'm doing pretty pretty decent about that. Or at least I try to be pretty decent about that. I feel like it's been working out pretty well. Never pick up the key this time. And there. Okay, so we're gonna um decline the olive branch this time well what about actually i wish you wouldn't talk about her that way let let's not fight there is a solution here somewhere i'm sure what were those death certificates about anyway it's a life insurance scam nothing more how's that work there is this doctor well a surgeon actually after they told us she'll be stuck in the apartment we got redirected to him and as far as the records go you died from the parasites i didn't even know i had any life insurance well, I got it for you too after you got quarantined. It's kind of curious they let you do that. So then, when we died, were you in on it? Of course not. I really thought you died. So your bodies had to be burned because of the parasites. So I never got. That's why I never got to confirm it for myself. Ah, she's full of shit. What? Where are you going? I have to finish setting this thing up for her. Oh, come on! Forget about this nonsense. Sort the documents out. Hey, you can, you can even live here if that doesn't work out. You can leave this whole mess behind you just like that. That's okay. I'm really not interested. What? But that that doesn't make any sense. Why would you not? I get it. That's that's all. That's a wild uh, reaction from the mom. What? Huh? Oh, this is that is disgusting, Andrew. She's just, just a free God's sake. I haven't done anything. What the hell, mom? Then what does she give you that makes it worth all this? What? Well, that's none of your business, is it? I knew something was off. How the fuck I'm so bad? I'm the worst mother ever. But, no, I mean, yes you are, but I have never. I'm back. Now of all times. I get the money. I got the money. Did you miss me, handsome? Did you? Did you? 
I want to die. Oh, well, there's some of the fucking demon already. Oh, so eager. Let's see if it shows up there. Since there's no music. Wait, what are you talking about? Quiet, you. I'm still armed. Andrew, light the candles. That's... That was a hilarious reaction. Alright, get to it. Hilarious reaction. Ahem. Hello, hello, Mr. and Mrs. Demon. I'm sorry I don't have the mood music, but I have the other stuff you asked for. It's not answer. Maybe if I sing something, please don't. Mercifully, the demon should- Okay, that's the same. Ah! Charge, though. What the fuck is that? Ah, for those two. They're screaming a short-lived as the demon steals their souls. Huh, I wonder if I should feel something. Well, anyway, so the music wasn't even summoning you after all. Why well, did I have to play it last time, then? The circle is hard to find. Sound is easy to follow. However, you have my talisman now. It makes you easy to find. Speaking of which. A deal's a deal. Charge it up, please. Your trick at works again. Thank you. What? Well, well, hello? This is the brother? That's right, my pride and joy. And no, you can't have a soul, it's mine. I will see you again, Tarsal. Sure, I'll make, you an I'll make another offering once the trinket needs to be charged again. I will summon you. Bring this one with you. What? Me? Why? Okie okay, dokie, bye bye. The entity leaves. And that's, and that's that. The trim is charged. Who cares? What do you do about the bodies? Who cares? She says, you kidding me? The bodies and he focus. Okay, so I think, so this is all this thing. So I'll probably, I'll probably look it up. Getting rid of the bodies, probably. Mm. You wouldn't. Come here, you. No, 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 no. Don't you dare. No, I'll fucking kill you in your sleep. Your last words? Forgive me, Andrew. Andrew, I'm sorry. I apologize. Fine, you're spared for now. Drain works. Let's get this over with. You and your brothers remember your parents. Okay, this is the same. I was gonna call this out, but I, I'm, I'm just gonna leave it in. Who is it? What? No, nothing, Andrew. You're tired, I can take care of the rest. What? No, it's, it's really nothing. I must be seeing things. Oh, what? I think I'd ever bear witness to you being a straw over at parents' corpses. Oh, right. Then again, I bet you're just moping over finally getting your hands dirty. And are you? What? Are you doing all right? As all right as I can be, considering the circumstances. That's good. You're being weird. Look, he's talking. All right, enough time wasted. Andrew continues casually butchering your parents. Incidentally, there's a knot in your stomach. Okay, so this is the same. So some of the dialogues are different, so I'm just gonna leave everything good. Cause I, I might as well. Cause I, I wanna get uh, both endings. I wanna make sure I have. I'm gonna make sure I've done as much as I can. 
Do you want a disease? What's up? Of course, I only offer you raw meat. You really take me for an idiot, don't you? I take you for what you are, idiot. Watch your mouth. This idiot just poured your parents down the drain. Ha, huh, alright, that's pretty smart, I guess, for an idiot. Outside and grab the stuff, and after I grab the stuff, I'll uh, throw my parents in the fireplace. Well, after we put this all in the pot, of course. Okay, now we're just gonna throw our parents in the fireplace. I'm eating too. Okay, I think I think this uh unexpected. Well well, how is it? It's okay. Just okay. I mean it's better than last time, but why are you so picky? It's really dry, you overcooked it or something. Mom's just a dry person, alright. And how the hell is it dry? This is soup. No, mom should be more salty. This is just bland and dry. I rate this waste of ingredients out of 10. Would not eat it again. Cash, you will, you will check that statement at once. A slave went in the kitchen for you, and this is the thanks I get? Sorry, you can't cook. You're not forgiven. Oh? Jackass, eat, shit, and die. This food is certainly shit. What? Well, come on, I'm joking. Not that bad, it's fine. More than fine. Yes, yes, fantastic. In a way, my dumbass can appreciate. How about that? <laughs> Yeah, why yes indeed, this cooking is beyond my mortal comprehension. Correct. And out of this world culinary experience, what's the likes of me can cannot even taste properly. Because my taste buds simply aren't evolved enough to sense all the subtleties. Truly, when I set waste of ingredients, I mean it's a waste to feed it to me. Food of this calorie should only be fed to kings, no gods, it's more like it. So exquisite is your cooking that I will write you a shitty poem about it. Oh god. Lo and behold, I implore you, come feast with your eyes on her, oh, and there's food, too. To ease your weary soul, she brew the broth to give you quite the fright. There must be magic on her fingertips to cook such a delight. And yet the meat is drier than her lips, quarter past midnight. <laughs> Shall I buy lip balm? And the meat isn't dry, goddammit, it's just right. <laughs> whatever, humans are hard to cook, I'll get it next time. What, next time? Oh, whatever, anyhow. I think we've dealt with the flesh to the best of our capabilities. Okay, this is the same. Time to throw some more soup in the trash can. Throw this good little soup outside. Alright, pick up these bones. This is the same. Sorry guys, it's like 2 a.m. and I'm recording this shit. Probably gonna, I'm probably gonna try to post this today, honestly. If if I can, uh, finish record, finish and edit the recording and all. I'm gonna try to post it today. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, so now we're gonna clean up this good old basement. Man, we're gonna really speed running this shit today. Let me get this mopped. Yeah. 
this. Talk to my good old brother. Oh, they're not ready to go, I think so. There, there's no way they can miss them. Okay, this is the same too. Take a, how about I take a nap? Okay. And now we are going to take a nap because I'm supposed to bring it with me. So we're gonna finish this. Okay, so this is the same. God, you can't read the lines for shit. That was me telling you no. I did get it. I just don't care. Stop being so selfish all the time. Let me try it. It's my trinket. We're here to share. How am I supposed to share this? You want to cut the trinket in half? Sure, that's a great idea. No, just. I'm not cutting it. That's not it. But I'm sure we can both fall into it at the same time. See if it even rest of the vision. Oh, it's a bit small. Between our hands, right? Oh my, how romantic. Come again. Fall the hands when we sleep together? Man, fuck off. Alright, forget this good night. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's fine. Uh, I still think I'm gonna be the one, only one who has a vision. We'll see. Good night. Good night. Fuck, how am I supposed to sleep for you when it says something so off color? It doesn't help at all. Mom said something outrageous too. Oh yeah, I heard that. Good, huh? So that's what that little show was about earlier. See her face? That was great. Who she regretted her entire life just then. Pretty sure she just regretted giving birth to us. I'll take it. If for once she regretted the both of us, I'm happy. What? Nothing. Good night. It isn't long till sleep takes you over. Okay, I'm gonna save. Gonna save it in 11. Pink plushie, a sucky drawing. They're just garbage. Do you want to turn on? green Put them around the rabbit. Oh, no, okay. The TV and you watch each other. More importantly, the episodes by Lele and Lele alone. Pink plushie sits by itself. I won't take the plushie. Saving a little again. Plushy. Father plushy won't budge. Mother plushy won't budge. Got green plushy. Okay, so these. So Lele is over there. So Lele, Andy, and then the parents. So what's She goes on the school. Look, I put them both in the bed. Plus, she's soon happy together. Okay. 
yellow and purple. Trash is locked. See if bring us some new successes. Okay, so uh, can I put the parents in the pot? Mom and dad. Mom and dad into the thing. Okay. Just close that. Okay, so if I put the pink one, which is supposed to be her, and so green plushie. Purple hussy. And the yellow floozy. The wishful thing perhaps. And then if I put the best thing out of the world, if I put it in the, the cage. They're all good. Enamored evening. So knife, knife and flower. So I'm gonna save over at eleven again. I'm gonna put the the knife here. The flower here. And it opens. Okay. So what is this? It's upon a lousy life. What's this one say? The end. So I'm gonna do the save on eleven again. Highly questionable idea. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me try this one. This let me try this one first. Saint Pass enters. Yes. Some souls in here and they're running for me. Empty bottle in the trash. A spirit. Okay. Can I put you in this water? Oh yeah. Can't reach that right. I'm trying to figure out like what's going on here. So I, I guess I'll water these flies. Okay, now I can get across it. Oh, excuse me. I'm not enough to care about it. 
Come on. I need more sticks. Oh my goodness. How heavy is she? She must be real heavy in all these jump sticks. There's one more tree, so I'm assuming I only need one more stick. Okay, I guess I don't need any more sticks. I guess I only need two. I'm gonna find out. Alright, there you are, finally. Into the bottle. It's into the bottle with you now. Just kidding. Got it here before it finds us. Andrew? Andrew, where are you? Right here. What the hell? Don't just run off like that. You see any visions? I take it you didn't. No, I couldn't sleep. I did. I think I saw some vision, but it didn't seem like anything important. It's just collecting ghosts or something. Nothing about getting caught? Nope, not a thing. Oh, okay, I guess it's a good sign. Well, you say you couldn't sleep? Yes. Oh my, and for a moment there, that you have changed. What are you on about? Nothing, nothing. Oh, I don't know. Something about getting caught red handed? Not the parent. Per Parenticide itself? Come on, let's go dish the bones already. For a second we waste it, is a second we risk getting caught. Alright. Not only have we committed patricide, but we ate the patricide. The little parental nibbling. Alright. What's he say to this song? I hate you. It's not my fault the stupid bag ripped on the song. I don't care how to pick him up. Okay, he's not as grumpy this time, so I picked him up. I talked to him. Thank God no here at the sour. He's gonna say that again. And then we're gonna zoom zoom out of here. Okay, this is the same. Okay, since my bag broke, how do we make sure the school's sick? Probably be fine. Okay. Well there they went. So they did. Should we recite a prayer or something? Let's not get too sanct sanctimonious here. I feel like we should, I don't know, say something. To put it past us for closure? Closure for what exactly? I don't know. It was just a thought. I'm starting to think you want me to be upset. I'm just worried. I know I don't give a shit, but I thought you did. I did. Uh, fine, let me think. Take your time. Dear Mom and Dad, thanks for giving me life. It's been awful. Thanks for giving me Ashley. And thanks for giving Ashley life too. She too has been awful. Hey. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you not want me to share my thoughts after all? Some eulogy this is, but go on. Sorry for selling your souls. That was very rude of us. But you sold ours first. So that makes us even, doesn't it? And that's all I have to say. Maybe he has changed after all. You seem a bit down. Are you sure you're not the one who wanted to say something? So then go for it. If not that, then what? Say now that this has been dealt with. Are we in the clear? Honestly, I have no idea. <sighs> oh my goodness. There's always the possibility I overlooked something. That's right, and I bet you did. Huh? But you fucked up bad, and we're just waiting to get hauled off to jail right now. Death row, here we come. Wow, thanks, Ashley. Really, wait, really, way to put my mind at ease. You got nothing to fear as long as I'm here with my trinket. I don't know. Then you just said the last vision was useless. Foolish, Andrew. If we'd be in trouble, surely the vision would have shown me that instead so confident pulling these assumptions out of your ass and i hope you're right don't you worry just leave it all to me but anyway what should we do now leave it all to you huh our next move andrew planet um well the money has brought us some time bought us some time but we still need to find ourselves some new art new identities do we really though can we just leave it up live in the car and mug random people for a living that's just not going to work for you love Every time we try our luck, we're more likely to get caught. Then can we buy fake identities? I know people do that sometimes. Point me to the guy who sells them, and I'll get a ride on that. Oh, that cultist club seems to be seems like a really sketchy spot. Maybe someone there knows someone who sells them. Probably not, though. Stop being such a defeatist. Let's go take a look, a little look. See, it's a crap idea to go anywhere near where he killed that guy. And also, that motel was the only one letting us stay with cash only. Fine, but we're leaving the car in some random parking lot. Since there's definitely an ongoing investigation for that hitman's death. Alright, cool, whatever. Let's get going. I have a mole here? You coming or what? 
And I'm gonna let me finish this. Waste of time and money. I love it. Uh-huh. Glad to hear it. Uh, okay. So I'm gonna save on 12. Okay, and then we're gonna do the last one, which is, I think it's the, yeah, this one. Somehow it looks like a highly questionable idea to take this route. Know what I'm about. Classmates. Parents. Siblings. Okay. Friends. So I guess that key unlocks this cage. Got the green plushie. Okay, so I can put the plushie on once. So I'm gonna save. Friends. Okay, so I, I guess I just put the plushie on all of them. This is my classmates. And then this one is parents. Okay, and I'll talk to this demon. Penny for your thoughts? No deal. Come on, give me one word. Mortifying. Huh? Didn't seem like it a minute ago. So I think you meant to say gratifying. Big words don't fit in your mouth. Yeah, something else fit, fit in it just fit in it just fine earlier. Oh yes, yeah, so mortified, aren't you? You know I'm easy to distract. Some guilty conscience you've got. Better than yours. Come here, you. Wait, gently, gently, goddammit. The vision ends without you dying. So at least there's that, you suppose. Well, you want their banter slot too? Burnt mayhaps. Oh, oh shit, you're awake. Well, hello to you too. Oh uh, yeah, good morning or evening, I guess, whatever. Right, so hey, did you get a vision? P probably not. Really, do you see dreams like that a lot then? I don't. See, you did see it. Quite the vision, huh, big brother? That was not a vision. The demon is messing with us. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's just that's just it. It's because we tried to be cheap and get two visions for the price of one. So it gave us a fake vision instead. That's the only explanation that makes sense. Oh, please. I mean, it is your turn here. Clearly, you are right and I wasn't supposed to use it. Sure, she keeps selling. I'm totally buying it. Screw you. Yeah, you just might. Fuck off. Do you honestly think that? <laughs> I don't know. You tell me. Listen, here you. Fucking spare me. I don't want to hear it. You just helped me discredit parents' corpses. Yeah, getting laid is what you're freaking out about? No one got laid. Yeah, you keep telling me I messed up. What a joke. We're not like that, are we? I don't know. You just come off that way sometimes. Huh? How so? A tad jealous. Oh dear, what's that? Wishful thinking? Tell, tell that to my ex. It's not pretend. You don't have a bit of a jealousy streak yourself. Now that's wishful thinking. Fat chance, get over yourself. I don't think I need to ask you this, but let me anyway. It's never gonna come to that, right, you and me? Never say never. Never say never, Andrew, my dear. Oh my fucking god. It's not funny. Don't joke about this. Why am I getting your hopes up? Or maybe something else? Say that vision get you. I'm out of here. Why is this such a massive issue to you? You've done way worse things together. Else they forget it would happen eventually. Why, 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 why are you like this? Why would you say this? Why would you think this? I right, wow. What a landmine, huh? Well, sure. I oh, forget this. Forget this whole thing. Fine, but this was clearly, that was clearly a vision, so it'll probably come up sooner or later. When you're less vision, a guy slit our throats. Yeah, here we are. So let's just leave it at that. All right, then, if you say so. Andrew just switched the, the elephant under the rug and calls it a day. And anyway, let's go throw mom and dad in the ocean, yeah? Okay. And then out the door we go. See what he says when the, when the skulls roll down this time.
guy, he says the same thing. Alright, and then away we go. Okay. Well, I bet, bet I can throw further than you. Bet you can't. Oh, yeah. Definitely. On the count of three. One, two. Ah! Ooh, what's that? Looks like I won. Filthy cheat. Nope. You never said pushing wasn't allowed. Oh, yeah. Well, here's your fucking prize, Jack. Has this fist to the fake. Aw, uh, hug. Why, thank you. Thank you. Oh, you're a little different lately. Am I no fun anymore? Um, more like, let me think. How have you been sleeping lately? Are you actually looking for a fight? I'm not talking about that. I mean, just in general. You're a somni or a nightmare. How are those? Uh, it's been decent, all things considered. Yeah? Unexpectedly, you seem to be doing just fine. Well, don't be happy for me or anything. Andy is all grown and doesn't need me anymore. Andy is dead. I don't think he needs anything. Even so, there's the trinket too. You're apparently the only one allowed to use it, so there's that. I don't know about that, but it clearly showed me one way to keep him around. I suppose, right, I'm honestly pissed we don't know what's coming next. It's really hard to plan what to do now. Alright, so what do we do? The money has bought us some time. Okay, this is the same thing. I'm just leaving the car. Yeah. <laughs> this is all pretty much the same. Like, ending lives? Ending lives are pretty different. Uh, let's get through this dialogue. I had a mole here. You coming or what? I mean, let me finish this. Waste time and waste money. Okay, so in both of these endings, he has a, a thing on his hand. So, 10, 11, and 12 are the are our endings well i'm gonna leave it here guys i'll see you all when the video gets uploaded and i'll see you again in the comments or wherever else um see you soon hopefully